Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of Real Talk with Real Recruiters. I'm Emily, I'm one of our members of the Talent Acquisition Team, and today we're going to be talking to some of our team members um, that help with allocations. Um, so we've got uh, Kelly and Autumn here, and we have Erica, who's actually a team member of mine, that um, helps do some of the hiring for allocations. So we're hoping that you learn a little bit more about the team and um, maybe you're interested in an opportunity with us. So. Um, what I thought we could do first, guys, is um, introduce yourselves and we could do a little fun fact and learn more about you and then we'll get into it. Sound good? Yeah. Okay. All right. So my name's Autumn and I'm a location planning analyst here at Burlington. And let's... I guess we'll pick a good one. <laughs> good, good, good. All right. Let's see. What is the last movie you watched? Did you like it? Endgame. It was Avengers <laughs> Endgame. Um, I saw it Thursday on opening night and I'm going again tonight. So, uh, yeah, it was good. Your turn. I don't want you people to say hi. My name's Kelly, and I was an allocation analyst, and I was recently promoted to a location planning analyst. Let's see. What is your favorite candy? Oh, Reese's, hands down. Hands down. <laughs> <Okay. Okay. laughs> uh, my name's Erica, and I'm a campus recruiter here with Burlington. Okay. Have you ever binge watched a show, and if so, what show? Yes, too many to count. Um, <laughs> probably the one I, I was the worst is probably Grey's Anatomy. Yeah. Yep. Oh my god, that's a good one to binge. Yeah. That is a good one to find. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Thank Thanks, you, guys. So, um, Kelly, why don't you start us off and tell us a little bit about what kind of day to day looks like as an allocations analyst? Yeah. So, a day in the life of an allocations analyst, it's every day is not the same. I mean, you never know what you're going to expect. Um, so everything, all of our orders that come in, we have to allocate everything to the next day. Um, and we have a, there's a lot of downtime. So in that downtime, we run reports. So just to kind of see how our business is doing, um, is there anything we can, can improve on our business? Or if there's any call outs, you know, can we reach out to our merch, merchandising team and our planning teams? Just, you know, get ahead of it. But like I said, no day's the same. Mm -hmm. So what do you think, how would you kind of, describe what allocations is in the world of Burlington to folks out there that are new to retail? So it's definitely a partnership. It's a partnership with your buying team and your planning team just to kind of like get the goods out on the floor at the right time. So if you have seasonal products, can we get them there like on time, you know, for the right season? I know we're still allocating a lot of spring at the moment and then we're looking ahead to fall as well. So, you know, just getting the goods on the floor and to the right regions and to the right stores. Awesome. Um, so Autumn, you have a little bit of a unique story coming to Burlington, so tell us a little about yourself and how you got here. So, fun fact, uh, Kelly and I actually went to college together. We, we went to the Fashion Institute <laughs> of Technology. We were both an international trade and marketing majors. Um, I actually started the company first. I started last February. Um, when I was working here, and Kelly was working at the time in New York City in PR, she wasn't really happy with what she was doing, um, and I told her I got hired here. And she was like really interested and really excited. And I was like, I think you'd be a great for the team. Obviously, I know Kelly personally. Um, so yeah, I referred her. Burlington's great because they really do take the referral seriously, as I'm sure you can attest to. <laughs> <laughs> they refer to their, um, sorry, they, they take the referral seriously. So when I referred Kelly, she obviously did great with getting here and yeah. her interview and everything. And I think she's really happy. And obviously, she's been promoted. She got promoted last Friday. Um, so yeah, that's our it's, just, I mean, fun it's story. just been a great experience, and yeah. I thank Autumn for you know really introducing me to Burlington, yeah. like the Burlington community. It's been amazing. Yeah, and this was like a complete coincidence. Like, <laughs> I got the email saying like, "Hey, would you like to do a Facebook Live?" And I forwarded it to Kelly, and she was like, "Oh, guess who's the allocation manager?" <laughs> <was for this?" laughs> but mind you, we do recruit others from other schools, yeah. other majors, and other backgrounds. Yeah, just, just a coincidence. <laughs> yeah. Good. Yeah. So Erica, as a member of the campus recruitment team, tell us a little bit about what your strategy is for recruiting and a little bit about kind of your role with this team. Sure, so I get to go out to a lot of local and uh, national colleges now and we go to career fairs, we get to speak at student organizations, in classrooms, and really explain all the great opportunities with Burlington, the career path, um, and then we bring in great talent. And then for the planning and allocations team, I currently get to recruit for planning and allocation interns and allocation analysts. Um, so Autumn, tell us about what you feel the culture of your team is like. What would someone expect coming here? Well, first of all, I would really like to point out that it's very diverse here at Burlington, which is great. There's so many different backgrounds that come together as one and work together as a team. 
I mean, just I have an immediate small team that I work with of other location planning analysts and our manager. And then there's the bigger planning team with our chain planners, our associate planners, our director of planning, our VP. And we all come together and we work together. But um, I mean, just in that small group, we have all different backgrounds, all different stages of life. So that's a really great part of Burlington, too. And just that we can all work together as a team, and that culture is great. And no matter what, we know that we have each other's back. So if someone's out for a day, we help cover their work. It's no, no big deal. Um, if someone is really busy at the moment and they need some backup, we jump in the system and we help them out. So it's just a really, it's a really great culture, and everyone's very supportive, and they want you to grow, and they want you to do your best, and they want to see you succeed, which is really awesome and important in a company. How nice. What do you guys like to do to have fun as a team? I personally, my favorite part that we do as a team was we go on team walks just oh, around nice. the building to get outside, get <laughs> some fresh air. Um, it's great just to step away from the computer screen for a little bit and yeah. get out and get some fresh air and kind of reset. Oh, good. Wonderful. Um, and Kelly, what do you love about working here at Burlington? What keeps you here? Um, I would say the number one thing for me is growth. Mm -hmm. I mean, the, the options are endless. Like I said, like I was promoted in under a year. I started with the June class. And just the culture, I mean, all of your ideas are respected and taken into consideration. And, you know, like Bur everything's changing, you know, there's constant change and everything's, like I said, like always happening. And I think that, you know, being able to roll with it and just, I, I just, I, this is the growth for me. Mm -hmm. It's so important. And I mean, I just really feel like I'm a part of a big family Good. for sure. Um, now, Erica, what do you typically look for when you're recruiting? What are some great skill sets or experiences that you could share with everyone? Sure. So, as I said, the backgrounds for allocation analysts pretty are pretty diverse. We're really open to a lot of different majors. We're open to a lot of different types of backgrounds, um, people who are just out of college or a couple of years out of college. But in general, there's a couple commonalities we look for. We want someone who really is analytical and data-driven. It's so important to be able to look at the data and use that to make those decisions. Um, we also look for in people who have a high level of intellectual curiosity and want to keep improving upon what we're doing. Um, and then the last big piece I would say, we're really looking for collaborative and team-oriented individuals because as you can see, we all do work together and it's, it's just so important to who we are to be able to work as a team. Wonderful. Well, thanks so much, guys, for coming Thank you. and joining us on another episode of Real Talk with Real Recruiters. Um, we hope that all of you learned something today about our allocations team. Um, if you're interested in learning more, please check out our website at um, burlingtonsdoors.jobs. Um, all of our opportunities are listed there, and we hope that you tune in for our next episode. Thanks so much.